In this video, I'll show you how to back up and restore your messages on WhatsApp on your iPhone. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like and let's get right into this guide. You can back up your WhatsApp chats and also restore them from iCloud or from your computer as well. So firstly, I'll show you how to do this using iCloud. So if you've already gone and backed up your conversations to iCloud, you can go and skip this first part because firstly, I'll be showing you how to back them up and then I'll show you how to restore them. So if you're trying to go and back them up, firstly, you need to go and open up your settings and scroll to the top and go and tap on your name at the top because we need to get to our iCloud settings. So this will then take us to your Apple ID and then tap on um, iCloud like this and wait for it to load. Then where it says apps using iCloud, go and tap on show all like this and scroll down until you go and see the option for WhatsApp. And as you can see, my WhatsApp is turned on, which is good. So make sure yours is as well. Close off your settings and then open up WhatsApp again. Now what we need to do is head to our WhatsApp settings. So go back to your chat and then you'll see the bottom navigation bar and you can go and tap on settings. Then from settings, go and tap on chats. And then in chats, you'll then have the option for chat backup, tap there. And what you can then do is either go and click on backup now or either go and toggle on auto backup as well. So I'm gonna go and tap on backup now. And as you can see, it's now backing up and it's preparing. So just remember that it is gonna to have to go and basically upload all your chats onto iCloud. As you can see, it's actually quite quick for me. So wait for this to finish. It's now finished. And as you can see, it says the last backup was today at 104, which is literally two minutes ago. So now I'll show you how you can go and restore your messages on WhatsApp. So to do that, all you need to do is go and delete WhatsApp like so. So I'm gonna go and delete it. And then what we need to do is just go and re-download it. So here we are on the App Store and here is WhatsApp. So let's go and re-download it now. And it's now gonna finish re-downloading. So let's go and tap on open and here we are in WhatsApp. And so what we need to do is go and set up WhatsApp again. So go and tap on agree and continue and then go and enter your phone number. After you've gone and entered your phone number, you'll then be greeted by this screen here, which says restore from iCloud. And as you can see, we can then go and tap on restore in the top right like this. And as you can see, it's now restoring. It's gonna to have to go and download all the data which shouldn't take too long. And there we go, and now it says over 8,000 messages have been restored. So just remember, all the messages are gonna be restored from up to when you last backed it up. So in my case, it was two minutes ago, but for you, it may be further ago or more recent. Then tap on next in the top right and go and enter your name and then you can go and press done. And that's it, WhatsApp will be back to when you last backed it up from. Another way you can go and back up your WhatsApp chats and also go and restore them is by using iTunes. Now, when we use iTunes, we're gonna back up our entire phone to it, not just WhatsApp. And then we'll also have to go and restore all of the data from iTunes from when you last backed it up from. So it's a bit more sort of um, extreme than just backing up to iCloud, but it is still possible. To get iTunes, you can get it from the Microsoft Store. And then once you go and open it up, plug your iPhone into your computer, tap trust on the screen, then go and click on the phone icon in the top left of iTunes, just like this. And you'll then be taken to this page here and then tap it again. And then you can go and see your device information. I'm gonna go and have to hide some of this just because it is um, personal. But what you want to do is come down to backups and then tap on this computer. And after selecting this computer, also just go over to the right hand side and press up backup now. And then your entire iPhone is gonna be backed up onto this this computer. And then if of course that's gonna include your WhatsApp messages, your photos on your phone, your entire phone will be backed up. So when you go and restore it, what's important to note is that your entire iPhone is gonna be restored to that backup. So you may go and lose some photos if you've taken more and everything else you've added more since the last backup. So just remember that. But yeah, click on restore backup and you can then choose the backup you want to go and restore from. And that's it guys. If you found this guide useful, then please consider leaving a like. Peace.